Hello everyone, if you don't know me already, I'm Tara the Dance Doctor, welcome to my channel. In today's lesson, I am teaching a four-part Kizomba ladies styling routine where we're going to be working on different hip actions, undulations, and overall body awareness. So let's get right into it. Hi everyone, I just want to take a minute of your time to talk to you about my Patreon membership. If you've been looking for a quick, cost-effective way to improve your dancing, excel at learning choreography, and get into shape, look no further. Each week I upload a Quick Tip Tuesday video addressing different physical, mental, and emotional aspects of dancing, sharing my insights from 31 years of dancing and 10 years of teaching. Things like how to do a body roll, turning hacks, how to be a great follower, five things all social dancers should know, setting and achieving goals, and learning and remembering choreography. I also share a weekly salsa class, which is aimed to help with corporal awareness, coordination, and routine memorization and retention. Each month, I create a 45-minute dance workout done to popular music so you can smile while you sweat and enjoy the endorphin boost without the gym. This comes to nine new recorded classes each month, plus early access to all of my YouTube lessons. And when you sign up, you also get access to all past classes, which is over a year's worth of content, all for only $10 a month. Go to patreon.com slash dance doctor to sign up today. So if you are a student of mine already or you've watched some other Kisomba videos that I've put up, I always start with basic one and basic two. But today we're going to be adding some different flavor to those two steps. So the first 16 counts of this routine look like this. We're going one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so I'm doing my basic one, my slow basic, but I'm slowing it way down. I'm going to take four counts for each step, which is a really good way for you to work on creating a little bit more resistance in your body. So we're really having to measure how quickly we change our weight and press into the floor and change the position of the hip. So I'm going one, two, three, hip on four, five, press, press, hip on eight. Okay, one more time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, and this is a real soft movement. We're not trying to exaggerate the hips too much. We're really just trying to make this movement a little bit more internal, okay? From here, I'm gonna do basic two four times. I'm gonna go one, switch, and one, switch, and one. Now I'm gonna do a circle, and then here, I'm gonna do a circle with the foot, okay? So the first two are step, and switch, and step, and switch and step a little bit angling my body on a diagonal step circle to the right step circle the foot okay so let's go from the beginning one two three hip four five six seven basic two one two and three four and five, circle, circle, okay? Those circles are gonna feel fast, so we wanna keep them nice and small. I'm not trying to create a huge circle with my hip. Nice and small, I'm creating it from my abdominal muscles, okay? Let's do this first section one more time and then we will do it with music. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, a, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, let's try the first section now with music.
moving on to the second section of this routine. I finish with circling my right foot. I'm going to do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, and I'm going to turn five, six, bring the feet together, seven, eight. <laughs> a little difficult to do that one slow, okay? So, first, I'm doing a saída. Back, side, forward, forward, and I'm going to rotate, okay? So I'll do that facing away. Back, side, forward, forward. I'm going to press into this left foot and rotate, sending my hip back with the left foot. And then I'm going to go five, six, seven, eight. And what I'm doing here is I'm rocking my hips side to side, okay? And I'm kind of using, again, the abdominals to make that happen more than I am using the knees, okay? Because those have two different um, looks to them, okay? So we go one, two, three, four, and five, six, seven, eight. Let's do that again. We go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And one more time. Saida. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now from here, I'm going to do two slow steps forward. One, two, step three, four. And now, I'm going to allow my torso to rotate, and that is going to bring my feet around and bring my feet together, okay? So I did one, two, I'm here, crossed on three, four, and then my torso goes, which kind of crosses my feet, and when I can't keep my feet crossed any longer, I'm going to allow myself to turn. This is like three quarters of a turn that I'm doing, but I'm not terribly um, concerned with the amount of turn. Just do what feels right to you given the amount of time you have, okay? So we go, saída, one, two, three, four, turn, five, six, seven, eight, slow, one, two, slow, three, four, turn, five, six, seven, eight, okay? Let's do that again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, turn, five, six, seven, eight. Let's now attach the first section onto this. So we start with our slow basic. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, and three, four, and five, six, seven, eight. Saída, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Slow, one, two, slow, three, four, turn, five, six, seven, eight. One more time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, slow, one, slow, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so now let's try sections one and two with music.
on to the third section of this routine. It looks like this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven, eight. Okay? So we are, we finished our turn and we are going to do another saída. One, two, three. And on this one, I'm going to bring my left. Uh, the top of my left foot to my right ankle, okay? And this is like the leader touched my foot, and so I brought it up here. Now, from this position, I'm going to undulate five, six, or whatever the count is. I can't remember. So we go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, okay? Um, it's... A good skill to develop to be able to undulate in different positions, not only if we're here in a specific position. And so undulating on one foot um, does take the difficulty level up quite a bit, but it, like I said, it's a good skill to have because it is something um, that we do need to do from time to time. So a good way to practice this is to first do this lower body undulation on two feet, and then see if you can take a little bit more weight onto your right foot, and then see if you can do it all on the right foot, okay? It does take a little bit of practice, um, and if undulations are something that you need help with, I recommend becoming a member of my Patreon page, which is patreon.com slash dance doctor, um, because I do have a lesson dedicated entirely to learning how to do different types of undulations. There are tons of lessons on that page, but if undulations particularly are difficult for you, um, that would be the one to check out, okay? So, we do our saída. One, two, three. Lift the foot on four. Now we undulate five, six, seven, eight. We are trying to isolate just the hips. Remember in Kisomba, we're not going to be doing full body undulations, okay? So we did that. One, two, three, four. We undulate five, six, seven, eight. I'm going to come out of it and do another saída. One, two, three, four, five cha cha, six, and seven, eight, okay? If you're not familiar with the saída to the cha cha movement, I recommend you watch my Kisomba Basics 3 video as I do outline it um, there, okay? So I do my Saida. I'm coming out of this first. One, two, three, four. I turn to the left. Five, cha-cha, six, and now I'm going to go down on my rock, seven, eight, okay? So I'm effectively kind of lifting up in the cha-cha to then go down into this rock, okay? So let's try it, the whole third section. Saída, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven, eight. Let's do that again. We go, one, Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven, eight. Okay, let's do the whole thing. We go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We go one, two, and three, four, and five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We go saída. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Another saída. Two, three, four, five, six, and seven, eight. Let's do that again. We go one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, 
four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven, eight. And one more time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and one, two, and three, four, and five, six, and seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and one, two, three, four, five, seven, and a one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven, eight. All right, let's try parts one through three with music. section of this routine. We are going to go one and two, three, four and five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay? So I am doing, uh, continuing on from the cha-cha that we did in the third section, so we finished seven, eight. I'm going to go directly into another cha-cha going up. One and two, three, four and, and then I'm going to go back in five, six, seven, eight with a stylized walk back, okay? So I do cha-cha. One and down, down, and walk, 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 okay? When I'm doing this stylized walk, I'm sending my hip back, back step, 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 okay? Um, in the cha-cha again, I'm going up, down, down, up, back, 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 back. Okay? Again, from the cha-cha, I go cha-cha, down, down, cha-cha, down, down, and back, back, back. Okay? After that, I am just going to do rock, step, rock, two, three, four, 
five, six, okay? So I'm going one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And this is a step where the leader is walking around us and we are just standing there doing what <laughs> makes us feel good and sexy. And for me, it's nice to just do a simple side rock there. You could also do a figure eight if you wanted to, but for me, I'm just doing a side rock, allowing the hips to tilt, okay? So the whole fourth section, we go one and two, three, four and five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And again, one and two, three, four and five, whoops, <laughs> oops, let's try that again. One and two, three, four and five, six and seven and eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Again, I like to think about using my obliques and my back muscles and my abdominal muscles to create that shift in the hip instead of just using the knees to make the hip tilt, okay? Let's do it one more time and then we will add the rest of the routine onto the front. So we go. One and two, three, four and five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and we can start over. All right, so speaking of starting over, let's try it from the beginning. We go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, slow, one, two, slow, three, four, five, six, seven, and a one, two, three, four, five, seven, and a one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven, eight, one, and two, three, four, and five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And one more time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, seven, and one, two, three, four, five, seven, and a one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven, eight, one, and two, three, four, and five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, now let's try the whole routine with music.
so much for joining me for today's lesson. I hope that you enjoyed it and you got something out of it. As always, don't forget to give this video a like, subscribe to my channel, and turn on the post notifications so you can see when I upload more stuff like this. Until next time, keep dancing. Do you want to be able to do this? And this? And even this? Well, then you need to do this. And this. And even this. My 21 day train like a dancer course gives you all the tools you need to transform into the dancer you've always wanted to be. Try the first three days free and see why dancers from all over the world are saying things like this and this and even this. Start training like a dancer today and unlock your true dancing potential. What are you waiting for?